Welcome to Cook Me Herbs Coding Class. Today, I'm going to show you how to use the Minecraft Pi Edition API and make an almost endless hole like this. Here. I'm going to show you the hole. It's very deep. See, it goes all the way through the world. And if I can get myself to fall into it, I'll show you what it's going to be like. Sorry, the frame rate's low. Um, it's kind of tricky to record Minecraft. Well, oh, I'm falling through the hole, and I'm about to die. I died. Yeah, that happens. So let me just respawn and press tab to get my mouse free. And now, to get started, pop open Minecraft Pi Edition and have like a world set up. And, oh, that glitch. Let me minimize the window, and pop open Python 2, which is right here. Uh, make this window a little smaller so we can see our code and Minecraft at once. Let's put it over there. That looks good. And file. Click new file. And let's make that window small too. There we go. I think we can even make it a little bigger if we want. And let's unminimize Minecraft. Like so. There it is. But go back to Python. Alright, so the first line, you need to get the API set up. So to do that, type from mcpi import minecraft all right and then on the next line you want to write from time import sleep that's so that you can have it wait this is going to be vital to not crashing your computer later. Wall true with a capital T. This makes a wall loop that goes on forever. MC that makes a variable called MC equals Minecraft. I spelled that way off wrong. Minecraft. There we go. Dot Minecraft. And the second Minecraft is with a capital M. The first one is no capital letters. M. Dot create. Spelled that wrong. Create. Open parentheses. Close parentheses. Then on the next line, write x, comma, y, comma, z, and whoops, I put a space before the comma. Don't do that. Could mess with things. This makes three variables. Equals mc dot player dot get post with a capital P, not player, but post. Open parentheses, close parentheses, and then that saves where your player is to x, y, and z variables. And finally, well not finally, but almost finally, mc dot set block with a capital B, open parentheses x, so the block at your player's x position, comma y minus one. So underneath your player's y position, comma z. So at your player's z position, comma zero. So right underneath where you're standing. Close parentheses. And this time it is really finally sleep open parentheses 0 0.1 and close those parentheses 
Now, we will press run and click run module. And it's going to ask you to save, so just click OK. And I'm going to call it. Oh no! Giant hole. So save. And now it is running, and there is a problem. I spelled player wrong. I spelled it with an E. So what we got to do is we got to fix that, change that E to an A. And now run it again. Click OK to save, and oh no! You're falling down an enormous hole. Ah! I can look up. Whoa! There's the sky way up there. And I'm gonna die. I died. So yeah, that's how you do it. That's a basic example of the Minecraft Pi Edition API. You can do a lot more with it, but I don't know how. Look that up. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out KidZ at the bottom right corner. And making these kinds of videos is really hard because I have to think of something new to code every single week. So can you leave a comment requesting something to code so that I don't have to do as much thinking? Because, you know, thinking is hard work. And yeah, because this is not the easiest. I could make unboxing videos. It's a bagel! Or game live streams. I'm gonna crash, I'm gonna crash, oh no, no, no! Oh, no. <sighs> f*** it. Oh, f but I don't, because everybody else does, and I don't want to do that. So, please, leave a comment. And remember, they're always listening. Always. That's how they can serve such great personalized ads.